Hello, my Pisces friends. This is your daily for the 15th through the 16th. Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. If you're new to the channel, welcome. Please hit the like button, share the video, subscribe to the channel. If you are interested in a personal reading, my website address is down below the video. Okay, guys? We have Shine Your Light, Archangel Uriel. Thank you, Uriel, for helping me to share my light with the world. Beautiful. What other messages do we have from Tarot for my Pisces friends for today? Messages for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and Jupiter signs. Pisces. Mm -hmm. <laughs> well, isn't that wonderful? Here you come with the moon. Um, strong, deep feelings here for someone. Okay? Three of Swords. Oh, tough energy, guys. Tough energy for today. Um, a lot of you feel disappointed. Maybe somebody was keeping secrets from you here. Somebody that you feel like rejected you, you know, left you, left you hanging, put you in a bad financial situation even. Somebody that you feel like was not there for you through thick and thin. Um, Aquarius energy here as well. Um, as well as Taurus, but um, I think you know this is something that there there's something that you guys don't know that I feel like you're kind of struggling with here about another individual. You're struggling with it. You don't know how they feel, and it's still it's bothering you. It's bothering you heavily here. Let's see why this is happening. Let's get some more cards here. Hmm. Huh. I think for a lot of you, you guys have, I think you've started a new relationship. For a lot of you, you've started a new relationship. Okay. And I think that, um, you know, but there are remnants from an old relationship here that's still very present, that's affecting, um, that's affecting you still. It's still at the back of your, you know, in your head. But because you're not clear on exactly what happened here you're not sure if this person really loved you and so it's like you are feeling someone else you're trying to you know you're trying to grow and learn from this um stand on your own two feet a lot of you have started a new business even you're getting your money up here but it's like you're coming from a place where you felt really like neglected okay really neglected now let me tell you guys there's another situation here there is somebody that has strong feelings for some of you and this person is coming back. This is somebody that you shared heartbreak with. Somebody that you have a very strong connection with. Somebody that left you or you left them. But they are having second thoughts because they know that you are the one for them. That's how they feel. That's how they feel. This energy can go vice versa. This could be how you guys are feeling about somebody as well. But that is what is happening here. Somebody is trying to get over the heartache that happened between you guys. Because there's three swords here. There's three swords there. Both of you guys share this heartache. And they are wanting to reunite here. Because they see you as the person that they want to spend, um, if not the rest of their life, an extended amount of time with, okay? They see real growth with you. But all of this is coming after, you know, things were hidden from you. 
after you guys were disappointed here, after this person left, or you left, however this is going, okay? And so somebody here is going to be like, why now? Why do you want me now? You never even told me you love me. You broke my heart, possibly involved me in a three-party relationship, and you just left me. So, like, why this two of cups now? Why are you coming back? That, that type of thing. Okay? Cancer energy here. Um, Aquarius, Taurus, Aries even. Maybe Libra. Um, yeah. But I feel like, you know, you guys share this heartache. Because I always say with the Three of Swords. That, you know, each of you has a stake in this. And then there's the reality of the situation too. So both of you may be hurt for different reasons though. Okay? Let's see what the influence is for you guys. Hmm. Somebody's waiting on communication. Somebody's been waiting on communication. Um, also, somebody has been struggling whether or not to communicate here. Whether or not to share their feelings. To share their feelings here. Thinking that maybe you will reject them. Okay? Or you thinking they will reject you. Depending on, you know, how this is going. But somebody is really struggling with like reaching out, wanting to. They're unsure about how it's going to um, play out. Okay? Let's see what the outcome is here. I think that um, if somebody does reach out, I think both of you will be willing to um, endure whatever you need to to bring this connection back together. But this is like a brand new start. Um, this is also divinely guided, you guys. I know you guys have been through a struggle. I'm not telling anybody what to do here um, because you have um, free will and so does the other person. But you also have uh, the power of discernment. You will know what's right for you innately, intuitively, instinctually. You will know. So, but I think first and foremost, you know, communication needs to be had in order. For you guys to be able to figure out like where you go from here. Okay. So my Pisces friends. That's what I have for you. And I'll speak with you soon.